in addition to some painting and some aesthetic repair, some blasting and cleanup, we've also asked together. at least one contractor to bid it's on reinstalling the mast. The mast was actually shortened over 10 years ago an in anticipation out. of passing underneath the Benicia Bridge when she came out here to the west coast. So there's uh, roughly 50 foot of additional mast and I believe it's in roughly eight different segments or pieces aft. It's actually welded to the deck in, in those pieces and uh, the contractor will remove those, blast them, paint them, reassemble them and with a rather large crane lift it up to the, the top of the ship and, and reinstall it. It's a pretty substantial project. One of the volunteers happened to work for Manson Construction, and they're a large maritime construction company. They do crane work all over the, the bay. They have uh, bridge work. They do dredging. And they're just down the channel. They're very close. So uh, they came together last Thursday at 8 o'clock. They had uh, some donated tug time from Westar for moving the barge crane. And they had a fairly large crane, 190-foot boom, 50-ton uh, capacity. And they were able to uh, drop the spuds over here on the side and access all the equipment. We had a power unit from Marad, two big containers full of gear from the ship. Of course, nine pieces of the mast and a few other components. And we were able to pull them off and get the deck clear, place everything on the dock so we can begin to access that. So that was a good day. There's a crew putting the big antenna mast back together down in the parking lot. That's a whole jigsaw puzzle there. We have a drawing that shows which components were disassembled in what fashion, and uh, we have a specification on how to weld it back together. And that's been transferred to the big ship, and it really is just a puzzle after that. It got mangled pretty badly when they took it off to uh, bring the ship out here, uh, and it looks like it was cut off by people who really didn't expect to have to put it back on. We had to clean up all the cuts that they did, try to make them as straight as possible, because it was really, it was a mess. They cut it like if we were never going to put it back together, so it was really hard. I mean, it was like, uh, like a beginner's cutting this piece together. I mean, it was, the, it was pretty rough, pretty rough. It was better than what we expected. It was actually really nice. I mean, we got it accomplished in one day. So we feel pretty proud about that. Actually, it went pretty good. Better than I thought it was gonna be. No, it's gonna stay there a long time. We're gonna be all gone before it comes down. All of my workers feel really good about being part of this. I mean, 
everybody was working with a good attitude. I mean, it was just making it happen. Benzimo.